Hi everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up the brand new Numskull Gaming Locker. So we've got the Xbox One here today. This is a really cool device that basically stores loads of your games. You can see from the pictures and you can store your controllers here as well, as well as your um, headset or any other accessories that you'd like to put in the actual drawer itself. So to start with, you're going to want to unbox everything from this box and lay it out in a way that makes sense to you, as this is going to require a little bit of assembly. So included in the pack, you will have a number of separate pieces as well as a number of screws as well. It will also come with this little micro micro screwdriver as well. So uh, this is what you'll basically need for your assembly. You'll notice actually if you take a closer look at some of the pieces, each of these pieces does have a number on and that will play into the installation today. So have a look at the actual numbers you've got on the item and then pay attention to the instructions I'm going to give you. So once you're actually ready to start, make yourself a little bit of space. So to start with, you're going to want to take section 5, which is the drawer, and you're going to want to place this on top of section 4. So you want to take section 5 and slide it onto this like so. You see that kind of slots in perfectly. And then after you've done that, you're going to want to take section 1. Section 1 is this side plate here, and that is literally just going to slot on to the side here. Easy peasy. So the drawer still comes in and goes out, and that's the bulk of that. So next up, you're going to want to take section 10, which is the um, it's kind of like the, the the base of the actual tower itself. So section 10 is here, and you basically want to slot that in here. So that's going to leave basically a little bit of a gap between the uh, bottom of the locker and the drawer. You can see that like that. So this is uh, section two, and this is probably the trickiest part of the installation, so pay attention here. You're basically going to need to get this onto the side panel here whilst also leveraging this section 10 upwards. So I'll give it a go now. So you're gonna want to slot this in like so, and then push it down. That is the hardest part done with, but now you have your drawer, and you have that part of the locker ready to go. So the next step is taking section three. So section three is the uh, section three is the roof of the actual tower itself, and if you'll see on the bottom, it's basically got these. Uh, it's got one curved slot and the rest a rectangle. So this does fit in quite quite nicely on the actual top of the locker. It's really self-explanatory where this goes based on the slot. So next up is the actual assembly of some of the finer details. Depending on which gaming locker you bought, um, this is obviously the Xbox One, you'll basically need to take this section now and place it on the top, like so. And then you're going to want to take the screws that came bundled with it and just screw these on. So when that is done, you're going to want to find section six. So this is actually uh, the left-hand side of the gaming locker door. So you're going to want to take the gaming locker, pop it on its side, and you're going to be able to basically just screw this straight onto the side of the unit. Cool, so when that is done, you will have one functioning door, like so. So you're just gonna want to turn this onto its other side now, and simply just grab the other door and uh, fashion it onto the unit in the same way. Cool, so, cool, so once that is done, you are pretty much nearly there. Um, we've got all of the pieces together now, the doors open and close and the drawer, the drawer opens back and forth. So literally the last pieces to add now, you'll see that the, there are these little slots on the sides. So there are these smaller pieces attached. Um, they should be number nine, but um, it's kind of self-explanatory at this point of what they are and what they are for. And you're just gonna want to Attach them to the sides. 
this way up and this is where you're going to end up hanging your controllers basically so there's one side there's the other cool and there you have it so there is the finished gaming locker you can store any stuff in there I don't actually have anything to hand but obviously for now I'm just going to put the screwdriver in here tuck it away and uh, yeah there it is a finished gaming locker opens closes put any of your games in there so yeah there we have it there's the xbox gaming locker and the instructions are the same for any of the other ones in this same uh, same product line if you have any questions or anything you need additional help with check out the links in the description of this youtube video um, and drop a comment if there's anything you're, you're really struggling with. That's it from me today. If you want to check out anything else to do with Numskull, just check out the other videos on the YouTube channel. I've got lots of announcements about upcoming products, unboxings, all that jazz. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching and hope this has helped.